My name is Quinn, and I am being hunted as public enemy number one. I come from Outpost 72, N72. The neural net is a mandatory neurological implant, a social network registry of citizens that everyone has installed in order to access the net. Hey guys, this is Saint Denial here, and you've just watched the beginning of the trailer for the free Steam game, Logout. Uh, Logout was produced and developed by Playwright Studios, and is described as a stealth action adventure based in a media-obsessed society called Outpost 72. It was released on May the 2nd, 2018. The listed features include manipulation of NPC behaviour using emojis, short narrative, stealth puzzles, original art and soundtrack, and two levels known as the subway and the city. The download's only 862 megabytes, and the system requirements are also pretty modest. I've only seen the gameplay in the trailer, so it's pretty much a blind run. We're going to find out more about the game as we play, and decide whether this free game is worth investing your time into. So without any further ado, let's jump straight in. Okay, so this is the main menu. It looks pretty uh, straightforward. Uh, the options are. Oh, what was. Oh, that wasn't options. Okay, that's credits. The options. There aren't actually any options. It's just uh, letting you know what the controls are. So let's get straight in. So our brother Sam's missing. Good to know. Suspected adrift. Don't know what that means. Your missing person report has been rejected. Okay, so we've filed a missing person report and the police are ignoring us. And now... Okay. This is bad. Dude, look at these effects, man. Not trapped in the neural net! And probably not a good idea to tell them what you're going to do, to be honest with you. Well, it looked like she landed on the ground then, like she was floating before we started. Okay, let's go for a walk. What do we got over here? Boring. I don't want to read things, let's play. Ah, so we seem to have like a brain... internet connection. Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay. So we need to make these guys angry. Okay, I see, I see. So we use this emoticon on you. Yes! Nailed it. Okay, so by sending someone an emoticon, you can change their emotion. Dude, how useful would this be in real life? Whoa! Oh! You hate each other now! Kick his ass! Yes! Love it. Oh, that's brilliant. Oh, we've got weak signal. Oh shit, he doesn't look happy. So we can't use our shit because we've got weak signal, so... We have to sneak over here. Ah, oh, they got me! Oh, I think they're going to blow my brain out. Oh, they erased my mind. Oh, that's not a good ending to this game. And we'll give it one more go. Kick his head in. I just like watching how they react when you give them the signals. Yeah, boys! Okay. New hardware update. Time for your scheduled update. Kick his ass. Yeah. These boys. Oh, we found a new emotion. Happy civilians are much easier to control and more pleasant to be around. It's true. Okay. Hey. Hey, civilians. So. Yay. Everyone's happy. I don't know what that means though. They're following me. 
I feel like this is going to draw more attention to me. Why is he immune? Oh, there we go. Made him angry. Well, that's a huge key. What? Why is he immune? Oh, is it because he's not a bad guy? Okay. So he can't make good guys angry. Can we just walk? Can I just walk straight in here? No, these are bad guys. I don't really understand the point of these happy people following me. Should we find out what happens if you go? Okay, so I die anyway. So, so what's the point of these happy followers? Oh, the signal's weak again. So if we just wait for Roger to turn around. Oh, they got me. Okay, so we got to the neural net and we turned it off. So now I can make them angry. Kill each other! While I pick up this key, real quick. Or quite slowly. Ah! Oh, there's some sort of magic they can see through glass! What is this witchcraft? Oh wait, do I need to go and get the key again? Oh, god damn it, hippies. Okay, okay, I'm gonna die. No! Roger! Oh. Game crashed. How does she know where I am already? I'm stuck. I really don't understand what these happy people are helping me with here. They just sort of stood looking. And now they've walked away. Brilliant. Okay, so I've just picked up that key again. Let's go through this door. Here we see John and Lalitha. Come on, get angry, guys. Well, what, what am I even doing in here? What's that? Sam Warren. Is that the guy I'm looking for? Okay, let's just say yes and go through here. Oh, it's all going white. Oh, it's because it's loaded up a different area. Okay. So these are good guys. Okay, I'm not following the plot here at all. Okay, I guess we've... I guess that we're going to go get the fountain? Is that what that on thing on the screen is trying to tell me? Let's find out! So we can't use the doors. And we've got weak signal over here. Oh, and there's some bad guys. I'm not getting into that shit. No one wants to be near someone who's sad. Oh. Okay. Well, I don't have the sad emoji, so I can't do anything about sad. Oh, wait, is that in the middle there? I see it. Protected because the signal's low. So how do I get over to these fuckers then? No! How would you know I'm here? Just because you heard footsteps. You don't know they're my footsteps. Oh, stairs. Looks hopeful. Oh, better jump in there. You're kidding me. I climbed all the way up the stairs and there's nothing here. Oh, well, at least to get points for realism. Jeez! Does it mean I can get away with walking past these guys? Okay, I guess it does. Okay, so that's just helped me somehow. Ah! Oh! Don't call me a special snowflake. Oh 
Oh, wait, but I've just gone through them when I was happy a second ago. Oh, man. Okay, this game lacks a tutorial. I don't want to run into any more info because I already know all this shit. He says, whinging about no tutorials. Okay, so a second ago, when I was had happy people around me, come on, come follow me, follow me. And you, come with. That's it. All I did was crouch. Okay, so crouching is working. No, I've still got spotted. No, I haven't. Oh, I don't know what's going on. Okay, well, I've got sad emojis now. It's good. Make this guy sad. I can't make anyone sad because I need to take down the Noro, 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 Noro network from over there. But the signal's too weak for me to make these people happy again. Come back, come back, come back, come back. Oh no, it's not. I've got you. Sick. So what? Now I've got these guys. I can sneak over here. Turn this off. Make those guards angry and get past them. Or make them sad. Let's make them sad and see what that does. Your mother has unfriended you. I can't use it. Just go for angry. There we go. And we're through. Position thing never happened. Fear is paralyzing. Hack mode. Targeting fire. I don't not understand that. Oh, he's furious! Oh, he's having a mental breakdown. I'm so sorry. I feel really bad for that. Mental health is not a joke. Hey, hello, I found a cave. Perfect. And I found a dead guy. Oh, what's happening to him? Ah! Oh! No! I tell you what, I'll help him out of here because he looks like he's stuck. There we go. He's fine. He's yeah. He's oh, his arm though. Oh, oh. I shouldn't. I shouldn't have done that to you. Well, at least we've got uh, another emoji, which is the last one to collect. I think. I don't know how. Arpit. Great name. But I think I could just run straight in and grab this one. Why does this guy keep messaging me with random capitals? It's either caps lock or don't, what's wrong with you? Uh, uh, oh, I, I paralysed them, but I don't know what that's done. I like that. They go purple, it's my favourite colour. Like you said. Oh, his missus has left him! He's Oh, my old nemesis, Metal Staircase. We meet again. Yeah, this is going up to the big thing I need to get to, right? Oh, oh, has he not spotted me? Fuck off, Jimmy. Jimmy. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry, man. I'm <laughs> sorry. I hate that I make you feel like that, Jimmy. It's not very nice. Eggplant emoji. That Apparently, that's... Shocking enough to like paralyze him. He hates eggplants. Severe allergic reaction. Is this telling me that I'm on the wrong building? Oh, there's a path. Signal is strong here. Door sealed again. Oh man, this is the third boss fight. Also known as stairs in this game. Well, there's bad guys there. Run! I got away from him! Oh, oh, this is not good. Oh, I thought I was going to go flying off the edge. Let's try this again. Oh, man, that's a long way back. Okay, so let's be more careful on this building this time. Not getting caught. Oh, but she's so slow when she sneaks. Oosht. Oh. Scream aim and fire, my friends. Straight past you. Thank you for coming. Now she's going up these stairs, totally cash. 
Oh. I don't know what will happen, but this is bigger than you and me. I see differently, Sam. The neural net is not just a means to suppress us. This social network is slowly removing the concept of choice from our language. I was no different. Wow. I used the neural net as a weapon too. This is you our bitch. only chance. I'm taking it. She's taking it. Take it. You can do it. Oh. We're going to log them out. It's still going. This is holding A for a long time. Here we go. Um, what does this do? Oh, okay. So all those people are dead. Yep. I've killed everybody who was logged in by logging them out. Wow. Oh dear. I mean, where do we go from here? I've already killed the whole world. Okay, so the system's rebooting. Log out. Okay. Wait, what? Wait, that's the end of the game. That's it. That's 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 it. Wow. I mean, I hardly see why you need a level designer or a fucking writer, to be honest with you. Okay, so let's talk about Logout, and we'll start with the sounds, voice acting, and sound effects. Uh, the voice acting was pretty good. Uh, the voice actor is called Tiffany Witcher, who did a great job on the lead. Uh, sound effects were clean, maybe lacking some originality, but the soundtrack was sinister. It helped to build suspense, and overall, I think the uh, soundtrack was a pretty big victory. So I'm going to give the soundtrack of this game... Uh, 2.5 out of 5. Graphically, Logout isn't particularly beautiful, and it won't be winning any awards on that front, but it wasn't an eyesore either. It was stylistically quite interesting, even if the execution wasn't of the highest quality. Uh, for graphics, I'm going to give this game a 2 out of 5. Now, clearly the game was much shorter than I first anticipated. I know it said it was a short narrative, but geez, it's very short. Um, the build-up about finding the brother kind of leads you to believe that there's some purpose to the mission. I uh, felt like it was a pretty good setup to the lore of an alternate reality that was going to expand into like a major story arc, so kudos to Playwright for that. There's definitely room for the story to grow because it is an interesting concept, uh, but the ending doesn't necessarily leave much opportunity to expand. So uh, for the story, I'm going to give this game 2.5 out of 5. The stage design was linear, which isn't necessarily a bad thing, but it was very basic, um, nothing new. It felt quite PS1 era, even though there were multiple emojis. They were pretty much all the same, and in the end made a little difference which one you chose to how you progressed through the stage. Stage design is only going to get a 1 out of 5 from me today. Next, the gameplay. It's pretty bare bones. Uh, run, throw an emoji, run some more, throw another emoji, you know. Uh, but the premise of the game is actually pretty solid and it could be expanded on in the future to include different emojis, uh, different effects, perhaps some more stealth elements or platform styles and an improved AI might improve the suspense and enjoyment of the game. Um, but for how it, the game is currently, I'm going to give it a 1 out of 5 for gameplay. I'd like to end this with a huge thanks to Playwright Studios who are based in the University of Utah. I'll leave a link for their social media in the description, go check them out. Uh, overall, I did enjoy playing the game, and even though I'm scoring it quite low, I definitely recommend giving it a go, just for the originality of the concept. Um, I'm sort of looking at this game as a sort of alpha of what it could be, with more time, more money, more resources, and perhaps more experience as well. Um, and on that basis, this game's going to get a 1.8 out of 5. That is the end of this review. I hope you've all enjoyed the video. Please leave a like and subscribe if you did, and check out my channel for more reviews, let's plays and live streams in the future, and I will see you all next time. Peace!